That's what Campbell's soup tastes like. This segment is pretty much talking about pick a struggle. Yo, pick a struggle. I have to pick a struggle. That pick a struggle, bruh. You need to pick a goddamn struggle. You have more than two struggles. If you have three, then that's it. It is over for you. You have to pick a struggle. Started. Mm hmm You are already messing up. Jesus. I don't want to be bothered. But anywho, we are making. I am making. <laughs> chicken noodle soup. As I get drunk, I should have put on some lotion. Do I look ass drunk out? I hate Facebook sometimes because I'll post something that people are like, Oh, since you're up, hey. I'm like, no, I don't want to be bored. You make it some chicken noodle soup. Chicken noodle soup. Got some garlic, celery. Are you looking at the food? Got celery right here. This is celery. Some celery chopped up, some carrots. Bell pepper. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Onions, little parsley, and uh some garlic. And then um I got some chicken boiling. Um, because that's gonna take a minute. And what I did was I had went to Walmart because that that's the only store that's really open. But I bought a whole chicken because it's cheaper. It was like four dollars for a whole chicken. And I plus when I do chicken stuff, I like the Dark meat and the light meat, white meat. Don't understand the difference between them, but all right. There is a difference, like taste and texture. There is a difference. To me, chicken is chicken, but all right. Yeah, to me, chicken is chicken is too. Also, but there is a difference, and I got some oil in this slow cooker. But I ain't gonna. I'm using it as a crock pot kind of. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I had bought a whole chicken, and then I had busted down. So I got some chicken boiling was just salt and pepper and some oil. I had to bust the whole chicken down. See, there's one of the legs and the thighs. Where's the titty? There's the titty. And then I got a... <laughs> and there's a wing in there. But we gonna let that cook. It's almost done. We're gonna let that cook while we work on our broth. Got like half an onion, then some bell pepper, and like a bag of carrots, and then some celery, and we're just gonna let that cook for a while. Then I got a I got a whole nother video on uh, down the on who busting down the chicken? Yeah, I got a whole other video on YouTube on my YouTube page, which is Dre Day all day every day, where I bust down a whole chicken, show you how to cut it all up, and so I do that because one is cheaper and two, you can use different parts of the chicken for like multiple reasons. So while I got the chicken boiling over there, I got the backbone right here, and this is what I'm going to use. I got the backbone and the giblets, the gizzards, whatever you want to call them and a little bit of fat. I got these pieces here so that I can make the stock or the broth, which I didn't know there's a difference between stock and broth. Broth is when it's made from the bone of the, the animal mm -hmm. and stock is just the meat of it. Like this, why there's veggie stock. There's no mm -hmm. veggie broth. Because vegetables don't have bone. Anyway, we're going to use a whole bunch of seasoning on this chicken and then we're going to throw it in there. We're going to throw some sea salt, some black pepper, and then... Bay leaves. Who? Bay leaves. Yeah, thank you. We're going to throw in a couple of bay leaves in there. We're going to throw it in with the vegetables. It already kind of smells good up in rural. I'm hungry. Then some rosemary, oregano, some basil. I'm seasoning it this way so that I don't have to add any more seasoning at all. Like this season is going to season 
the vegetables while they're in there, and then when we put chicken in there, it's gonna that's enough seasoning for that. And then we add water to it, it's gonna be seasoned for that. So we just getting all our seasoning and then it's out of the way. And paprika. Then, um, thank you. Paprika. Paprika. Yeah, paprika. Paprika. Ain't this salt? This this thing is so neat. I'm gonna have to steal it from my mama. No. When I go to my own apartment, cause she don't even use this stuff. I mean, you're right, but <laughs> <laughs> I use it at least. Right. And then uh, thyme. Nice little dry rub. I'm about to sneeze. And then we're gonna throw it in. I'm loving this jar right now. That's done for it. Right. I'm at. I'm still this too. Okay, when I say, okay, just look, look. The final little. Right. As he proceeds to put a little water. Yeah, just a little bit of water. <laughs> we can go ahead and take the wings out because the wings don't take long at all. So we're going to take the legs, the thighs, and the wings out. And then we're going to leave the titties in there a little bit longer. You know what? This is already getting on my nerves. Should've cut knife. No, you just use my fingers. I don't mind the cold, and I damn sure don't mind the hot. He's in the middle. Right. And then I save those fatty pieces for the dogs. Mm. Oh, this smells fucking heavenly. Okay. So we're gonna just. It's not how you use a knife. I know, and right? take out the fork. Right. I'm just gonna. This is not how you use anything. <laughs> Cut this chicken out. <laughs> Try it again. Right. Make sure you have clean hands when you do shit like this. So we're gonna put the chicken in here. Yeah. So we got it all cut up. What we're going to do is, we're going to put some more water in here. But we're going to use the water that we boiled the chicken in to begin with. So we won't lose none of that flavor. Remember, this is just a little water. Yeah, just a little bit. I don't know why I don't measure. I really don't know why, to tell you the truth. I just do not know why. I like measuring. Make sure I didn't mess up anything. Right. Now, when it comes to baking, oh, Hell yeah. I measure like it ain't nobody's business. I'm gonna put some parsley in here. I was gonna put it at the end, but I'm gonna go ahead and throw it in there now. Oh, look at that. That's how I wanted it. Yeah. How does this smell? A uh, bustle of flavor. <laughs> I'm terrible at describing things. Right. It does smell good, though. Alright, now I'm finna fish out because we're almost done. Because we've been on live for almost an hour. 50 minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and fish out this bone and these giblets. Do the way. Your decision to grab it with your hands. Okay. Look at that, you got one carrot. Right, that's all I wanted. Let me know what you think. You gonna feed it to me? Hell no! <laughs> Here, give me this. All right, there we go. It's so dark. No, I'm just black. No, it's the light. But it'd be all right. But <laughs> one, two, Sweet. Mm. 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 Tell you, my mouth is on fire. <laughs> <laughs> my mouth is on fire. I like it. You like it? Dumpling noodles. These are uh, like eggish noodles. 
Right, they don't take long to cook it all. For sure, no. Yes! So we're just gonna throw these in here. I got a Should I do both bags? Yeah, I'm gonna do both bags. There we go. And then, see, that is perfect. That is just beautiful. That is a blessing. You can't tell me. You can't tell me that don't look good. And then we got our treats for Jazz. For Jazz and Mayhem. And then we got a treat for me. It's my treat. Oh, let me see if you can see. These little dark pieces right here. You see that? Those little dark spots right there? This little dark. No, yeah. you, you can't see with the camera. But yeah, it's um let me grab a bowl. Sometimes when you boil meat and stuff, you'll see like the oil and the the like the liquid oil, the liquid fat of it rise up to the top. And what you want to do is you want to skim that off of the top. So that your food won't be so fucking greasy. You look in the bowl like this right here. That little dark stuff, that oil stuff. You don't want that in there. God, why do I got to be so left-handed? All right, there we go. I'm trying to think what the hell else done happen. Ooh. It's nothing but oil and fat. We got a good chunk of it out. Would you like some crackers? Right. There we go. Chicken noodles. <laughs> okay. Mmm. Oh, damn, it's good. That is good. And knowing some black person, they're going to put more salt in it. I felt so bad skipping a show, you know, this past Sunday. I don't like skipping shows. I like to do something. Like last time, when they had closed the studio down, we had made biscuits and mashed potatoes and fried chicken. Mm -hmm. So it was like, you know, I wanted to do something. Um, but hopefully we'll be back in the studio next week. We'll see. And if not, we're going to do another cooking show. Because I actually like when we do these. I actually like these. What you think, Misty? I like them. Make sure um, follow us on Facebook. Follow us on Instagram at Pickle Struggle 2020. And um, we're on Facebook at Pickle Struggle Show. We're on YouTube, Pickle Struggle. Catch up, my friends. Uh, a good friend of mine, Paul. Paul uh, P.O. Coulter, who also works at Fishbowl. Check out his show which is called The Extra Point. Let me make sure I'm getting this right. Fridays at 10 o'clock. A.M. or P.M.? A.M. Girl, who the fuck is doing the show at 10 P.M.? Uh, some people. No, nobody. Who knows? At 10 o'clock, 10 A.M., he helps you get through lunch and all that. Or it could be 11. Because he does a two-hour show. It's at 10. I'm pretty sure it is. If not, it's at 11. If not, just go to fbrn.us. It's there. Uh, make sure you check out um, what's another show that I like to listen to? Um, Matt Locks and Mo. They got Matt Locks and Mo. They are live on Sundays um, at 6 p.m. to 7. They talk about hair stuff, black owned businesses, um, they talk about, you know, uh, natural soaps and shit like that. And um, Mo, who's part of Matlocks and Mo, she does vagina talks, which are so good. Misty, you need to watch one. Mm -hmm. She does vagina talks on Wednesdays. <laughs> either Wednesdays or Thursdays. God, I feel so bad. It's either Wednesday or Thursday at 7 o'clock. Wednesday. P.M.? Wednesday. Who's doing a 7 a.m. show, Miss? Some Day? people. No. <laughs> Guys. No. 7 p.m. on Wednesdays. She does vagina talks. You know, it's mostly for women, but she do a little man stuff on there too. And um, 
Paul show, PO, uh, Paul Coulter show, the extra point he does, sports analysis, which um, the Super Bowl, you know, uh, football is over. So what is it, like basketball now? Uh, yeah. No, basketball was just a few months ago. The playoffs were just a few months ago. So I think now it's baseball. I wonder if he's going to talk about baseball shit. American Maybe, sports. Yeah. And then who else? Who else, who else, who else, who else, who else, who else, who else? I think that's really it. Those are the only people shows I actually have time to watch. Not that I don't watch the other shows. These are the only shows I got time to watch. And make sure you check out Pick a Struggle on Sundays at 5 p.m. at Fishbowl Radio Network, FBRN.us. And um, we got, uh, LaPria and I, we got a whole bunch of stuff planned coming up this month because well not this month but this coming up month in March because March the 15th is our anniversary and then I think it's February the 28th is our 50th episode so I can't wait so catch us watch us share us like us subscribe to us and I will catch y'all later deuces in the live girl I'm done I'm tired my throat dry uh, right. are you ready yeah. okay so, this is going to be Misty's first. first Biscuits. Close that curtain. Alright. Ooh, snaps. So, all you need... Well, no, this is your video. You say it. Oh, God. <laughs> all you need is two cups of flour, three-fourths cup of milk, six tablespoons of butter. And that's basically this much. Yeah. Better. Right. And then, I'm sorry, I didn't read out the rest of the ingredients that her, but you should have. Me. I know. Uh, baking powder. God. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yes. All right, baking powder and sugar and salt. Sorry, are we using all purpose flour or self rising? All purpose. Okay, then yeah, you do need all that. If we had self rising flour, you would need all of this. Okay. So in the bowl, you're going to mix your two cups of flour. Okay, all right. And uh, let's go ahead and mix in a tablespoon of the graduated sugar. Ugh. But we made chicken noodle soup earlier. Looks fucking delicious. One? Yes. One tablespoon. Alright. That's good enough. Alright, and then um, one tablespoon of baking soda. I'm sorry, baking powder. <laughs> Why don't you use the one that's in the refrigerator? That's baking soda. You sure are right. Ooh. Anyway, um, uh, one teaspoon of salt. And the only reason we're doing this is because we have all-purpose flour. We don't have self-rising flour. If we had self-rising flour, we wouldn't need to do all of this. Alrighty. That's a teaspoon, right? Mm -hmm. Alrighty. So what you're going to do is, is you're going to mix all that up. Mix it up! <laughs> I mean, a fork, a whisk. Ooh, get the, not the food processor, the uh, hand mixer. Because you're going to need it for the butter. As a matter of fact, uh, warm that butter up. Like, put it on the top of the stove top so it can soften up. They say use very cold butter, but I don't believe in that. And that's a little trick. Um, when you preheat, I'm going to zoom in. Not on you. Oh, I didn't mean to zoom in on you like that. But uh, when you preheat in the oven, like we all we got ours on 350, and then you need like some softened butter, just place it on the stove top. That's the way I do it, and that's what softens my butter. Got your mixer, Jesus, uh, Misty. <laughs> I'm joking. Slow, girl. You don't need it that fast. All right, mix it. Mix your dry ingredients. It's very slow. Is that is that's the slowest setting? Yeah, one. Oh, okay. Yeah, just leave it on one. 
Mensch, keine Ahnung, Mann. Mensch, du hoch, Mensch, du hoch, Mensch, du hoch. Okay, you're done. And then now you're gonna make a, make a pit in the flower. I know how to do that. <laughs> make a pit in there. Yeah, there you go. There you go. And then that, that's where you mix your six tablespoons of butter and your milk. Now we're using whole milk, but only because Misty decided at the last minute she wanted biscuits. If I would have known that earlier, I would have grabbed some buttermilk. How was I supposed to know that you were going to cook chicken yeah. You just asked me what seasons we have, like Mother does. <laughs> <laughs> like, okay, I'm going to make something. You're asking for seasonings. Right. Now, what you do, uh, slice that butter up. Slice your, your six tablespoons up in thin slices. Because we forgot to soften it, so we're just going to go with the flow. Go with the flow. You have to just, yeah, just, yeah, that. So, Misty, where are you from? Tell us a little bit about yourself. Uh, I'm Misty. You don't need to know my last name. <laughs> <laughs> I'm from Texas. No, you're not. Oh, yeah, I'm from Arkansas. Thank but, you. <laughs> <laughs> whatever. I'm raised like a Texan. I'm raised like a Texan. Whenever I go to other states, they say I look different. Oh my god, why people are just texting me? They always call you when it's something not important. Right. Uh, I'm from Arkansas, Little Rock, capital. <laughs> I like to draw. I like anime. I'm a youth. You woo? I'm a youth. <laughs> I'm a Gen Z kid. I don't like going outside. Okay. You got all your six tablespoons? Yeah. Thank God. All right, enough small talk. Now, blend it. And they had to do in the video, they'd be like, ah. Jesus Christ. What? <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay, I'm going to put the butter in there. Yeah, that's how you want it to be. But you might want to clean that off, girl. Clean it off. You know what? As a matter of fact, leave it right there. And you might want to clean off your counter space because you're going to need that to make the biscuits. All right, got your counter clean. Okay. So, your rolling pan. Yeah, your rolling pan. And some flava. You're going to need some flava. Now, have you had one of these? Woo woo. There it is. How you get on your shirt already? <laughs> you already know what you're doing or you want me to tell you? I know what I'm doing. I've seen enough cooking video. Okay. Okay. I put it in here, right? <laughs> I took out the dough, right? You said you knew what you were doing. I know how to do the counter thing. <laughs> I'm sure they took it out of the bowl too, but. It, <laughs> yes. Take it out of the bowl. Yes, just pour everything from the bowl and on those mixers onto the. Ca no, not like that. Okay. You ass. Oh, tell us a little bit more about yourself. Uh. You, oh, Jesus. Because <laughs> you don't want to hear me sing. Unless you do, and I can sing a little waiting song. Put it down in the comments below. Right. Okay. Uh, well, as I said before, I like anime. Right. Which, okay, yeah. What's your favorite? Okay, what are your top three? Because I know there's a shitload of them. What's your top three favorite animes? Hunter x Hunter. Mm -hmm. That's the first one. Second one's Kakagori. And the third one? Vlad Love. 
So you didn't like online sword? Wait, I don't watch sword art. Sword, sword art online. What is it? Sword art online. Yeah, you said. Yeah. I just don't. I don't not in that into that kind of anime. So there's different types of animes. Yeah, you know different categories. Okay, so what are the categories you like then? I like action. That one had action in First it. First off, there's a difference between what I like and action. Mm. Uh, action, supernatural. I hate drama. Okay. Um, I can't remember the entire. You might need a little bit more flour. Showed you I. A little bit more flour. And make sure you put some on your hands too. Girl, no. That is not how we feel it. There you go. Now, what you're going to do is, this is what you call kneading the dough. Mm -hmm. Any day now. I understand. So you're making it into a ball to where it's all cohesive. Oh, like clay. Yeah, like clay. I'm also um, in art. <laughs> Yeah, no, yeah, she can really draw. Girl, I said into a ball. What the <laughs> hell is you doing? <laughs> I'm sorry. This is like play. This is what I learned. Yeah. Okay, is it all cohesive? Is it all together? No. Okay, then keep going in until you... Until it feels like it's a ball to you. To where it's like all together. Only way you need more flowers is if it's sticking. Is it sticking to the counter? Mm. Then yeah, you're doing good there. Perfect. Yeah, you got flour on the roller? Yep. All right, now roll it out to where it is about... I'm trying to see an inch thick. Half an inch. Almost, yeah, half an inch. You might want to put some... You see how it's sticking? Yeah. Means you need more flour. Now, uh, grab a glass with um, the circular... Okay, yeah, 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 let's do that. So, wash your hands, butter your pan, get the flour off your neck. Right there. Look, look, she's white. <laughs> and put the butter on the pan. And put the pan in the oven so the butter can melt. I'm sitting here re-watching the live. Later. Deuces. In the live, girl, I'm done. I'm tired. My throat dry. No. <laughs> this is too funny. Cut the biscuits. Oh, you might want to put flour on the cup. I'm sorry. I just did. I'm sorry. You got a timer? Yeah, yeah, it does. Okay. I don't know what time to put them on. Why would you ask me this? Why would you go ahead and say 10 minutes? I don't know. I just be eyeballing them. Look at him! They look so delicious! They're gonna look so much better if you put some butter on them. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna do. <laughs> Ooh, did I do that wrong? Look at that, look at that, look at that. All right, I'm taking this one. All right, the moment, the moment of truth. How do these biscuits taste? Mm. Oh, they're good. Mister. Mmm. Eat it with this good old chicken noodle soup. Mm-hmm. 